everyone it is joe the lawn warrior back with another video and it's actually the day after christmas so i hope everyone had a wonderful christmas with friends or family or whoever you celebrated it with but i got something really interesting in my lawn and i want to talk about it and show you guys what i'm going to do today so let's get started So over here on my section of my lawn right here, I have these white circles. I got this green spot right there. I got a green spot right there. And I got a green spot back there as well. And I have no idea what's going on with this section of my lawn. It's just really weird. We did get a little bit of snow, but not like too much. Like maybe a dusting or a coating if that. So what did I do? Just like any other good lawn tuber out there, went to Google. Went to Google and I typed in lawn disease for dormant lawn. And what do you know, a video came up and I watched a video. It was by a, a channel called Budget Lawns. Kind of, I like that name, Budget Lawns. It's probably saved me a lot of money if I watch that channel. But I uh, watched this video and he actually lives in Arkansas. And I didn't know that Arkansas actually got snow. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? So after watching Budget Lawns video, I decided I want to diagnose... my lawn for what i have and i'm going to diagnose my problem as snow mold as well so what's really weird is actually on this side of my lawn as well i have a white oval as well and I'm, i don't know if it's a sign or something someone's trying to tell me something but i'm not going to run away from this challenge we're not going to do nothing nothing what i'm going to do is i'm going to go out to lowe's i'm going to go and hopefully they have some sort of fungicide some disease x something left over from the, the springtime and the summertime so i'm going to get myself a bag of that i'm going to throw it down into the various spots in my yard and my host spigots right now are winterized for the winter time so i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to hook right up to my tankless water heater i have a hot water tankless hot water heater in my house so I'm gonna hook right up to that get some nice hot water out here hook it up to a sprinkler water this all in and hopefully within the next week or two all the snow mold all this goes away so I won't have to look at it for the remainder of the winter time so there you guys have it if you think I missed the mark today I'm an idiot. You're an idiot. please leave it down in the comment section below let me know what I could do better um, you know I just like going on Google trying to figure out this stuff myself you know if I can and if it works it works you know if it doesn't hey it's just grass at the end of the day right guys so that's what I'm gonna do I'll check back with you guys hopefully within the next couple weeks see how things go see what I could have done better maybe if, if I maybe I'll try maybe if this fungicide doesn't work I'll go get something else maybe some maybe maybe it's an insecticide problem maybe I'll go get some of that and throw that some of that stuff down if this doesn't solve the problem but I'll check back with you guys in the next week or two but it let me know in the comment section again if I could do anything better and like always guys if you found today's video helpful make sure you smash that like button it really does help out with the channel and if you're interested in any of my other content I'm available on Instagram I'm available on TikTok go check me out there and like always guys I'll see you in the next one Ooh.